I'm going to show you how to register for myaccountinglab.com. This assumes you do not already have a Pearson account. Pearson is a publisher of our textbook and the publisher of myaccountinglab.com. So first we need to open our browser and go to www.myaccountinglab.com. Myaccountinglab.com works best with Chrome and Firefox. For this video, I'm using Chrome. Since this video assumes you do not have a Pearson account, we need to click on the student button. Notice we're registering. We're not signing in because we don't have a registration already. So we're going to register now, click on as, as a student. And notice it says, we need to turn off the pop-up blocker for this website if we want to use this. So we click the X, click here, say always allow pop-ups from this site click done. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to close the browser. And then when it reopens, it will allow me to register. So I reopened the website, went back to myaccountinglab.com, and I'm going to click on student. Now this page says we need three things, an email address, a course ID, I'll supply that later in this video, and it says we need an access code or a credit card too. But that's actually not true. I'll show you how to skip that part and get a free trial. If you bought your textbook new from the school's bookstore, the access code should come with the book. But again, if you don't have that access code now, that's okay. So we're gonna click on okay, register now. Now it's asking you to enter your course ID. So enter this code. and then click continue. If we had a Pearson account, we would sign in here. But since this video assumes we don't have a Pearson account, we will click on create. Also notice that the name of the course is over here. So always check this to make sure you've got the correct course. So now I'm going to fill in this information, but it's critical that you remember the email address and password that you use, especially remember the email address. That may sound obvious, but some students forget. Now that I fill that in, I'm going to click on create account, which is down here. So instead of having to worry about using an access code or paying with a credit card now, I'm just going to click on get temporary access without payment for 14 days. And that will get us up and operational as soon as possible. Are we sure we want temporary access? Yes. So we're done. We now have temporary access, or at least I have temporary access to this online course for 14 days. And to go to the course, we can go click on go to my courses. And here's the course. We can click here. And now we're in myaccountinglab.com. And we can click on doing our, we can click here to do our homework. Go back to the main menu. We can click here to read the Pearson e-text. And after that, you would click here to read the Pearson e-text. And now I'm going to show you how to log in from now on. So I'm going to log out. And then I'm going to show you how to log back in.
So from now on to log back in, you just go to myaccountinglab.com and you click on the sign in button.